Hi everyone, today I'm going to be showing you how to upload your own Minecraft mod pack to the Twitch launcher. Uh, this video is going to be less than 5 minutes, so let's get right into it. So first things first, uh, you click Minecraft, you or you click Mods, Minecraft, you click Create Custom Profile, you name the profile whatever you want, I'm just going to name it uh, Bay Plays. Uh, you're going to select the version and you're going to select the mod loader, and you're going to click Create. Uh, the bottom, it's going to make a new version. It's going to be named Bay's Plays. You're going to click this. You're going to click more, get more content. You're going to add the mods you want. Uh, to be accepted on the Twitch launcher, you have to use the Twitch launcher mods. You can't add any third-party mods or it will automatically get denied. Uh, so I'm going to go back twice. I actually have a mod pack that I've made, and it's up here. It's called Bay's World 2. Uh, to actually get the files that you need to upload to the curse for or twitch launcher or course forge whatever you'd like to call it you click the little gear sign on the far right side and you click export profile in this you're going to be naming it whatever you want the packet version the config the mods and whatever else you would like to save you're going to just click export you're going to save it to your desktop and that's it after saving the document to wherever you saved it at, uh, you go to this URL, authors.curseforge.com. It's going to be in the description of this video. You can just go there. After doing that, you're going to log into uh, your CurseForge account or you're going to make a new account. Uh, I just logged into my Twitch account because they're uh, both, uh, they both are affiliated with one another. So it's easy just to log into your Twitch account if you have one. And I'm assuming if you're uploading to the Twitch launcher, you'd have one. You click start project. Uh, you're going to select a category, which is going to be mod packs. You're going to name whatever you want. So I'm going to name it uh, Bay's World 2. We're going to put the summary as that, and we're also going to put description as that. And when you scroll down, you're going to choose the project license. You're going to choose the category. So I'm just going to choose a few of them at random. Make sure they're not the same or it won't show as a primary. It's kind of weird. You're going to also have to upload a logo image. Uh, which is 400 pixels by 400 pixels. I actually have one here as you right here So you just drag and drop or you can choose file location you click start project And then after doing so you're gonna go on the right side. You're gonna see file You're gonna click that you're gonna then locate the file You can either drag it or you can choose file and then upload it uh, You're gonna name it whatever you want here display name and then change log You don't have to touch unless if you update it then you can put a change log you I actually I'm pretty sure you have to put a change log just to verify like what you did so they can update it uh, for the release tape to uh, put release select the minecraft version which is right here scroll all the way down and click submit fo file uh, this is going to pop up it's going to show you the file type which is release if it's alpha or beta it's going to be an a or a b here's the world size uh, or not world uh, this is the mod pack name the size of it the uh, when you uploaded it the version how many people download it and it, the status it's going to be processing right now it has to be approved by the moderators of curseforge uh, once approved it's going to say approved here it's going to be green and people can then also download your mod pack and search it up on the twitch launcher if any of you guys have any issues feel free to write in the description or feel free to write in the comment section down below um, the description is going to have the URL of where you have to go make your profile and stuff like that. But I hope everyone enjoyed watching. If you are uh, not subscribed, make sure to hit that subscribe button. If you like this video, it is very appreciated. Um, and if you click the notification bell, you will be notified whenever I release a new video. But I hope everyone enjoyed watching. I hope everyone has a great day or night. Uh, be safe and I will see all of you guys in the next video. Later.